Your Storm Team AccuWeather forecast on demand. I'm Chief Meteorologist Austin Onig with your Weather on Demand segment, thanking News 12 viewer Wayne Carpenter from Decatur for a nice view of some distant lightning bolts. That's our Langley Roofing weather window picture of the day. You can see that picture by going to our website. You can also drop off your photos and see what other people have been submitting. You can email your pictures to us or you can drop them to our social media pages. We don't have a lot going on right now because high pressure is still in control over the entire eastern seaboard, and that's what's been giving us some very dry air dropping down from Canada. Now that this area of high pressure is moving east, winds are starting to turn around that high pressure to the south, aided by some low pressure areas to the west of all this moisture. This is going to help to fuel more clouds, rain, and eventually some thunderstorms heading our direction as we go into the weekend. Now we may see the potential of some severe weather. What we're going to be looking at is the main threat well off to our west into the Great Plains, but there is a possibility we could be on the eastern edge of a possible severe weather threat, a marginal threat, which again on a category of five is about a one. So not looking at a lot, but again, northeastern Alabama and western parts of the News 12 viewing area in southeast Tennessee should be monitoring the weather this weekend so we can keep you advised. What we're seeing is again scattered showers and thunderstorms, a little breezy for Saturday, and then more showers and thunderstorms with warmer temperatures as we head into the first week of June. Another check your forecast coming up later on News 12. If you can't join us, go to WDEF.com slash weather.